This is 17, I'm sorry, 17 Riverdale Avenue at the YMCA Fire Department uh, came to the scene on a report of a fire in the kitchen. Let me say at the corner no, 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 right no, no, here, this door. Back, so as you guys see, the police off. Oh, okay, okay. That is. Those are the people that reside there, so we tell you to step back over there, sir. Behind, over there on Hudson Street, okay, on the corner of Hudson. Well, th there is nothing here, sir. There is nothing here. On the corner of Hudson River, there, sir. Please, thank you. As you guys can see, firemen all the way on top of the roof. Sir, if you don't mind. Just now let me show you guys the song, the area so you understand the police officer he asked me to go around the corner which there is no reason because there is people right here as you guys can see there is people walking around so there is really no need but somehow he wants me all the way around on the next stop Now let me show you another person right behind him, and he's not, he's not concerned with nobody else but me. It doesn't matter if you reside or don't reside. Officer, reside or don't reside. If it's safety, then everyone should be there. I'm not, I'm not going any further than this. I have the right to be right here. There is always someone that objects people to film. I understand the safety reason, but as you guys can see, the, the possible fire is at the YMCA. The firemen are uh, working on it. And there is nothing that I uh, am obstructing. But don't push me. Do not push me. But don't push me. But do not push me. Don't push. No, I'm not failing. I'm not failing to listen. Don't push me. Don't push me. But do not push me. Don't touch me. Yeah, there is always one. Huh? There is always one. Now, the, this is the excuse. The, the, that's the excuse. That's the excuse that. How are you doing, sir? That's the that's the, the the excuse. I'm giving you a lawful order. Now, as you guys can see, there is people at that door. Which you I don't have a problem. Yeah. Okay. As you guys can see, there is people all over, but somehow the guy with the camera is the one that uh, is obstructing whatever it's going on. As you guys can. Yes, I'm crossing. There is people right here. There is people right there. I, I, I really don't understand sometimes what the problem is. You know, with filming. As you guys can see, there is nothing going on here. The issue is inside the YMCA. The firemen are, uh, are working, so are the police officers. But you always find one police officer that has a problem with people filming. And then they use those words that we all know, I'm giving you a lawful order, uh, go across the street and all that. So they have documentation, but so do I. As you guys can see, the man, it's still at the corner. I couldn't stay there because I was obstructing, but the man's still there and the police officer has no issues with him. There you go, as you guys can see, he just passed the man and he said absolutely nothing. There is no obstruction there. But if I was there, which I was, right at that same corner, I was 
given a lawful order, he calls it, for me to go to the other side of the road. But not that man. He's still there. He is still there. He's there. The officer that was concerned with my safety is there. And the man still there. Now I'm across the street in the island in the middle of Riverdale. And as you guys can see, the firemen are now still you know, getting ready to leave. I think everything is under control. And the man still there talking to the police officer. He said the man resides there, but look, if he poses a danger to himself, to the others obstructing, he, regardless if he lives in the building or not, he shouldn't be there at the same corner that I was. And those are the things that sometimes pisses me off. Why can some people stay and other people cannot stay? Yes, we respect the police officers, but come on, be logical.